Well, if it's my old nemesis, Got That Junk. Welcome back, Got That Junk. It's good to see you. It's really good to see you. Welcome back. Um, perfect timing, like I mentioned in your video. Uh, I'd love to hear your perspective on the absolute insanity that has infected the political parties here in the U.S. How crazy the campaigns have been from the president on down to the most goofy school board member. But I don't know if you're up on the latest news. I'm sure you've heard about the 47% that Mitt's words were supposedly taken out of context, that uh, he didn't care about half the nation, basically. But just now, I've been reading on Facebook and other places that in response to Mr. Romney's uh, understanding of his wife Anne's experience with an electrical fire during a flight, he couldn't understand why you couldn't open the windows, roll the windows down in a plane to get air in, to circulate, to remove the smoke from fires. So uh, I'm not sure if that can be taken out of context. But for all the people that are beating on poor Mitt, I just want you to understand that you really need to leave Mitt Knee alone. It's not fair. It's very hard running for president. It's very hard having people examine you when you're used to telling others what to do. So please, got that junk. Uh, your thoughts, I want you to respond to my video. I figure I'd, why not throw something at you right away. And tell me what you're seeing on your side of the pond. As an American, how does it make you feel leaving home to us goofballs and what we're doing to your home country? I miss you. I hope you stop by Blog TV and do more shows, listening to great music. And I'm Chunks of Earth, and so are you. Peace, man.